The Bible says, God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. They say when someone wins the lottery, they have more friends than they've ever had before. But when you're in debt, you can't find anyone to lend you $5. And that's the truth. When you're on the mountaintop, everyone wants to be there with you. But when you're in the valley, it seems that refuge fails you. No man cares for your soul. And yet the God of heaven, the Bible says, is our refuge and strength, not only when we're on the mountaintop, but he's a very present help in trouble. The Lord is the one who's there when you're in the valley. The Lord, the Lord is the one who's there when you can say with David, no man cared for my soul. The Lord is the one who's there not only in the trouble, but he's a very present help. You walk into a classroom and take attendance, you may see people that are present, but they're not very present. If they may be there in body, they may be there at times in mind and focus, but you couldn't say you're very present. That would mean you are 100% there, attentive, and ready to partake in whatever's happening. But when it comes to your trouble, child of God, I want you to think about that God says, I'm a very present help. I'm not just there. I'm all there. I'm not just around. I am 100% focused, attentive, and able to help you through this valley and through this problem. The Lord said in Psalm 50, Call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver thee. So today, as trouble comes across your path, as I'm sure it will in this wicked old world, remember that God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. He was with Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in the fiery furnace, and he'll be with you, very present, in whatever trouble you go through, if you call upon him.